I know you've heard me talk about it before, and I truly mean it. Claims is the place to be. So one of the soapbox I've been standing on, and I'm sure some of you have heard me talk about, is the fact that Claims is the place to be. And I kind of get bothered when folks talk about claims being basically entry level and a good way to get into the insurance industry. That kind of bothers me because I think of claims as a career in and of itself where you can do so much to help people out there. It's amazing just by listening, caring, and empathizing. Because that's the most important thing to the claims professionals is the listening, the caring, and the empathy. Because that's what we're there for is to help these people through a terrible tragedy. And I know Carly mentions this. She was speaking to an executive that said, if you're in a claims unit and your neighbors around you haven't been emotional, brought to tears at some point, you're probably in the wrong company or the wrong department. Remember, there's only one thing that insurance companies are selling out there. It's a promise. And what's the promise? That the claims team will be there to help people pick up the pieces when it's all fallen down. The claims team are the ones that are assisting people through these situations. And the claims folks, we have so much impact on our company's bottom line. Now there's a term that I absolutely love right now, referring to claims specialists as retention specialists. Now the math tells us that a retained customer is more profitable than a new customer. You always hear about claims giving money away and costing companies money, but how about when they're keeping money, when they're retaining customers? All the math tells us that a retained customer is more profitable than a new customer, so when us claims folks, we had that interaction that decides if that's a wow moment and you have a customer for life, or we can just go through the regular process, make it difficult for them, and lose them to a competitor. And then never mind about insureds and consumers, start thinking about the claimants as well. Somebody that's not even paying us a premium. We could care so much about them that they sit back and go, man, that guy at that company cared so much more about me than my company. I know if that's me and my company, doesn't care about me as much as the other guy, that's not gonna be my company too much longer, right? So listening, caring, empathizing, keeping that promise, retaining business, bringing in new business, how is it possible that claims is not the place to be?